But first, there are some heavy hearts tonight in Marion as family and friends remember a four-year-old little girl who died after her family's home caught fire. Tonight, her father is speaking out. Giacomo Luca is live tonight from the devastating scene. Giacomo. She's my daughter. She's she's very, 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 very special. Jody Brimer was at a complete loss for words as he spoke with me about his four-year-old daughter, now gone after a fire late Friday night burned through the family's Marion home. He describes his daughter, Lux Brimer, as a rambunctious, beautiful, and intelligent girl full of life. He's Quite honestly, it's probably not even hit as hard as what it's going to. He says she was young, but had an arm and would have made a great softball player. She honestly could have been anything she wanted to be. Friends and family have created two GoFundMe pages that have so far raised more than $6,000 to help pay for funeral expenses. Several area churches are also collecting donations for this family that's lost everything. Their biggest loss, one that can never be replaced. And you always think it won't happen to you? And all that, just, you hear people say, you know, hug your kids tight, which we did every night, every day, every morning. So, I mean, but still, if I just could have had, you know, one more second, anything, you know. The American Red Cross has offered to put the family up in a hotel for the next three days until they can find a more permanent place to stay. Funeral services for Lux will be this Friday at Merman and Wilson Funeral Home. Visitation will last from 10 a.m. to noon, with the funeral starting at noon. A new poll just released shows the majority of Americans now feel it's more important to protect the right to own a gun than to place restrictions on them. 52% of people surveyed said they would rather see more protection for gun rights laws.